Okay, Peaches, you have 10 seconds to qualify for the Littleton Dog Show. Ready, go! Oh, you've nailed every obstacle. Good, Peaches. What was her time, Shawnee? 9.83 seconds! She just qualified for the dog Yay! show! Yeah! You deserve a reward, Peaches. Peaches has come a long way from where she started. <laughs> nice work, Polly. Oh, thanks, Shawnee. Peaches and I have both learned a lot over the last few months of practice. Ever think of becoming a professional pet trainer? <laughs> I do love animals. It's all about being calm and commanding. Hmm. Polly Pocket, professional pet trainer. It does have a nice ring to it. Training dogs is one thing, but training cats might be a different story. Think you can train my cat to be more cuddly? <laughs> I'll have Collie Wobbles purring in the palm of my hand. Yeah! <laughs> Red alert! Pocket world alert! <sighs> What's going on, Lila? I was cleaning Bonita Bunny's cage when I found this! Huh? Huh. Hereby invited to our treehouse for a Pocket World pet parade. RSVP with your paw print to join us. I thought one of you might be playing a prank on me or something. Hmm. We should investigate. Let's figure out why someone is sending these. Peaches, give me paw. Okay, we got this from here, girl. Get back in the house. Go on. Peaches, no. No! Peaches! Come back! Oh, girls, we have to get her. There could be a pocket world full of missing pets on the other side of that portal. And their families might never find them. Unless we rescue them. Pocket world hero style. Tiny! this. <gasps> that sounds like Captain Collywobbles. That is Captain Collywobbles! Collywobbly, you can't be in a pocket world alone! Come here right now! <sighs> Once I find her, we're signing up for Polly's pet training. Captain Collywobbles! Come back! Hmm. Peaches! Where are you? <clears throat> Get down here! Come now! I think she's brushing you off. Oh, no! She knows I don't give up that easily. I'm coming up there, Peaches! <coughs> hey, furry friends! <coughs> oh, there! I'm a friend. Just on my way up to see Peaches. Stop, sit, and stay! Stay! Please! Uh, confidence is key, Polly. Gotta show these animals who's boss. Uh, ooh, ooh. Who said who? The head of this tree house, of course. And you're Polly Pocket, hmm? Instead of commanding those pets, had you considered asking what they might need? Hmm. Um, no. I guess I hadn't. That much was obvious. Who? <gasps> who? 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 You're a talking owl. Well, obviously. All creatures talk. We just don't all speak your language. I wish I could communicate with animals. Then I could find out why Captain Collywobbles is so desperate to be alone. You need your space. Pets need ours. Speaking of which, this is a private event. No humans allowed. So you sent the invitations. <laughs> but why no humans? Uh, because we pets need a break. We love our families and our homes, but sometimes we need to relax and play in our own special way. People have so many rules to follow. Eat this, don't eat that. Chase this, don't chew that. Come here, don't go party there. 
Ay, ay, ay. It's exhausting. Huh. It is when you put it that way. <gasps> now I wish I'd let Bonita come here. I never really thought of things from Captain Collywobble's perspective. Mm -hmm. wow. Pets are great friends and listeners, aren't we? Yeah. They're for you in good times and bad. Sometimes it helps if you stop talking at us and start mm. listening to us. <laughs> wow, Al. You really are as wise as the legends say. My name is Featherwing. Peaches, it's me. Can we talk? <laughs> oh, did I hurt your feelings before when I told you to go inside? I was trying to keep you safe. I'm sorry I upset you. Oh. <laughs> Thanks, girl. Starting right now, we're making more time to do things you want, not just what I want. <laughs> Creatures of the Pet Party Treehouse, commence the pet parade! <laughs> And Collie Wobbles and I had a real breakthrough today. Turns out, cats just need more me time than the rest of us. Yeah. How about you, Polly? Still ready to be a professional pet trainer? Hmm, not quite ready. Turns out training a pet isn't just about coaching. It's about listening to what your pet needs. So for now, I'll spend more time listening to Peaches. What'd you think of that, Peaches? Oh. <laughs> 